Dear students, our new C program for Q array implementation. Our program is starting with stdio.h and stdlib.h and we are defining a maximum size for our Q here. You can add any number 5, 10 or how, many, how much data you want. So define the max size equal to 5 here. Okay. Then we are just declaring the insert function, delete function, display function. We are declaring and initializing two integer variable friend equal to minus one and also rear equal to minus one and uh, also declaring int q maximum size. So here the size is five. So we are declaring q of five. Now our void main function choice for choices like insert an element, delete an element, display the q elements, etc insert the element option the choices are in the switch case we are calling this we are calling this insert and delete and display functions case 1 is for insert and case 2 is for delete and case 3 is for display and case 4 is for exit and the default cases and the valid choice this is our void insert function this is this variable is for getting the value new value for insertion and the element scanning the item value and here the rear equal to max size minus one that is our rear is pointing to the very last element of this queue then we can print overflow and return it from this function otherwise the other condition is if front equal to minus one and rear equal to minus one that is the Q is empty now. At that case, we are setting front equal to 0 and rear equal to 0. Else, we are setting, this is the normal case, rear equal to rear plus 1. And after this all, checking of all the condition, we are inserting this item into our Q of rear. Value inserted. This is our delete function. and this function, we are declaring an integer data type item, integer variable item for storing the deleted value from the queue. And if friend equal to minus 1, we are printing underflow and then return from this function. Otherwise, saving the queue of friend value into our item variable. Okay, maybe our queue contain only one element. At in such situation, friend equal to rear as that we all know. So, if friend equal to rear, we are setting friend equal to minus 1 and rear equal to minus 1. Because after the deletion of that only one element, the queue should be empty. In the else condition, the normal case, friend equal to friend plus 1. We are deleting from the front side. So, after deletion, we are incrementing the friend value and printing value deleted. That is the deletion function in the display so this is the display function here the rear if friend equal to minus 1 empty q the q is empty otherwise we are printing the value i equal to friend i less than or equal to rear i plus plus the q of i okay so this is the display of our q array implementation so let's run so after compilation we will get the exe for our q array program now we are executing this In the main menu insert an element delete an element dis display the q and exit under the choice first we are inserting the value 100 now again value inserted again we are inserting 200 okay uh, so two value already inserted now we want to insert another value 300 you want to display so 100 200 and 300 that is the q value delete 2 2 so 2 so only delete from friend side that is 100 will be deleted so just display so 200 and 300 is there in the queue that is the output for this program okay thank you